What up, y'all? This is your boy, the Evil Collector, coming at you with another action figure review. Today's review is with the Marvel Legends Controller Wave, Madam Hydra. And I was able to get her from Amazon today, guys. Go pick her up. I only got her for $22.99, free shipping, because I'm, I'm a Prime member. And anyways, let's get to it. Um, looks cool from the side. You get the artwork from her there. Same thing on this side. On the top, you get the the Hydra logo, which looks cool. UPC, if you need it, there it is. Pause it. On the back, you get more image of her with her bio, and then all the other figures that come in the wave. Dope, dope, dope. Her bio reads this. Okay, pause it if you can. And uh, looks like a simple, cool figure, but uh. Let's get to it and open her up and see what uh, she's about. So here we are with Madam Hydra out of the box and looking cool, man. You know, like for the most part, you know, she's my favorite color green. So I'm cool with it. I appreciate it. But it's pretty much a basic mother of uh, female body mode they have. Nothing major, no double joints. Um, pretty much just like Jessica Jones from the Amazon exclusive two pack, the body, except for the arm parts, has a little uh, deco around the arms, or the upper arms or biceps. The head movement pretty much hindered. But before we get to articulation, let's uh, check out what she comes with, which is just another pair of hands, fisted hands, to replace her, her hand gripping hands that have, have guns. And uh, her two guns she comes with, which is not much. It's just two guns redeckled with a uh, crocodile Dundee colors on the handle. So nothing, nothing too crazy, nothing out of the ordinary. Pretty much reuse parts, uh, pieces. And then real, real quick to her articulation, she has no head movement at all. Even though she has the joints and the ball, the ball peg, uh, the hair hinders her from moving anywhere, just left and right. Uh, upper shoulder movement is good, 360 all the way around. Uh, single jointed elbow, she has. She also has a wrist swivel. Upper torso movement is good. A little limited maybe. No waist movement. Um, doesn't do the splits really because of the upper parts of the thigh. And upper thigh movement is good all the way around. Double jointed knee she comes with. And ankle rocker with the pivot. So she's pretty much your basic uh, female body mode, like just like we said, um, nothing major. Uh, her hair, her, let's get it, let's look at her face real quick. Her face is okay, it's not bad. You got the uh, green lipstick, the green eye, um, eyeshadow, green eyeballs, the pupils. The eyebrows look a little San Antonio West Side kind of, you know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it looks uh, looks cool. The hair is okay, no, looks basic, not too much structure, not too hard, but not too soft, but it still hinders them hip moving around to look up or down. She pretty much, I, I gotta say like, the Jessica Jones, the body almost, it's just little parts, the deco different. But yeah, so here she is, Madam Hydra. So what I wanted to do, oh, also real quick, sorry, she comes with the controller right leg. If everyone's interested in knowing that as well, because it comes in the package. So if you want to build the controller, the right leg is with Madam Hydra. And then we also have this head scope I have from the Wolverine X23 female version. The I think it's yellow and blue. But the only thing is that the peg does not fit in here. The, this needs to be dremeled more. So I'm definitely going to dremel this out more. So I can put on her. I think it will look kind of cool and just repaint the hair green. Maybe do a little green lipstick and all that. And she'll kind of have like an... I want to say more of an old school peel. I could be completely wrong, but I feel like this head sculpt would have been more better for her. But um, I'm going to customize that and put it out and, and, um, and do that. So here's Madam Hydra. And um, some compar size comparisons. We're gonna, I'm going to go ahead and throw in there Red Skull. Red Skull's right there. Looking cool. And then we'll do Baron Zemo also from the Walgreens exclusive. And then this is from the... Uh, Zendo or Zeno, I'm not too familiar with that uh, build a figure that he came in with a super villain cell uh, wave, but um, <laughs> excuse me, so that's that. And then I also got a Captain America right here, 
I just want to throw in there. Cat, looking cool. And I, let's check around what other female figures as well I have. So we'll put those there. I'll do Jessica Jones from the Amazon 4-pack Defenders. Pretty much to me the same thing. I'll do my Black Widow Retro Wave one with the with the uh, Riders, uh, the two pack, uh, the Riders bike one with the two head scopes. I, I prefer that head scope over the retro one. And then we'll just throw in Mystique also, just almost, almost the same kind of body figure. Maybe a little different here, maybe a little shape different, like we could be wrong. I think mainly me, these two mainly are, are identical, except for, like I said, the bands. And uh, and that's it, y'all. Just my, a little quick review of Madam Hydra. Hope you like it. Comment below, let me know what y'all think, if you're gonna pick it up, or you're gonna pass on it. Um, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Take care, my peeps, and evil out. Like and subscribe to the Evil Collector channel and hit the notification bell for more content.